democracy, in order to live, must become a positive force in the daily lives of its people. It must make men and women whose devotion it seeks feel that it really cares for the security of every individual, that it is tolerant enough to inspire an essential unity among its citizens, and that it is militant enough to maintain liberty against social oppression at home and against military oppression abroad. Remember that in these brave days in the affairs of the world, we need internal unity. I have a dream that one day this nation will rise up and live out the true meaning of its creed. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. I have a dream that one day on the red hills of Georgia, sons of former slaves and the sons of former slaves will be able to sit down together at the table of brotherhood, I have a dream that one day We shall overcome deep in my heart, I do believe we shall overcome. No, I join hands often with students and others behind jail bars singing. We shall overcome. Sometimes we've had tears in our eyes when we join together to sing it, but we still decided to sing it. We shall overcome. No, before this victory is won, some will have to get thrown in jail some more, but we shall overcome. Don't worry about us. Before the victory is won, some of us will lose jobs, but we shall overcome. Before the victory is won, even some will have to face physical death. Physical death is the price that some must pay to free their children from a permanent psychological death. Then nothing shall be more redemptive. We shall overcome it. Before the victory is won, some will be misunderstood and called bad names and dismissed as rabble-rousers and agitators, but we shall overcome And I'll tell you why. We shall overcome because the arc of the moral universe is long, but it bends toward justice.